G'day guys, it's Ben from Coastline RV again. Welcome to another episode of Tech Talk. Frequently asked questions guys, and uh, we've had some clients ask, 240 volt power connection to your 15 amp caravan. So predominantly caravans are either kept in houses or in storage. If you're lucky enough, you'll have a 15 amp dedicated point at your house or at your storage unit. For the most of us, we don't. Uh, so a lot of people getting around with uh, little adapter leads made up, guys. These are highly illegal. Um, good excuse for your insurance company to avoid any insurance policies you've got if the worst was to happen, like this one here, starting to melt at one end. Um, they were readily available for a long time, however, have always been illegal. Um, so you've either got two choices when it comes to plugging your caravan or motor home into power at home in your storage yard. So one is to get a dedicated 15 amp point installed by a licensed electrician at your house. The second is a great Aussie company called Amphibian developed some portable devices for us to legally plug our 15 amp caravan lead into a 10 amp point. Uh, point in case here are their two models guys. Um, so we have a, a, a non-waterproof and a waterproof variant. Uh, this little guy here allows you to plug your 15 amp caravan lead into the female end. This is the indoor use only. Uh, and this straight into a 10 amp point. There's a little 10 amp breaker built inside these units so we can't draw any more than 10 amps worth of power. Uh, and for the second model, the RV Plus, the waterproof variant, as you can see, it's got a nice waterproof housing here. Your 15 amp caravan lead is fed through the top here into the point itself. The little 10 amp breaker is down the bottom. Uh, and when you close that on your lead, it becomes a waterproof device. Uh, these have become very important in our industry and uh, especially for the end user so that you're guaranteed uh, that your insurance policies are all up to date and nothing's going to be voided if the worst was to happen. The next thing is all your caravan leads have changed. The female plug-in has now uh, got a mandatory collar on it. So we're having some difficulties with the old Clipsal power inlets not being able to be uh, fitted with the new leads. So you may have to retrofit and upgrade to a new uh, Clipsal power inlet for that purpose. And last but not least, Amphibian do a waterproof joiner for your cables. So these are available to join two cables together legally, they're waterproof. And their latest product to market is a surge protector. So these have become invaluable as well. So the amphibian is basically to uh, save your life and protect the house and the van. The surge protector is to protect all the appliances on board in your van. So these can be used at your caravan park or at home. And basically it's like uh, your large surge prote protector boards you'd buy from any of your large distribution stores like Harvey Norman or so forth. This is uh, a thousand joules, so it's pretty much going to protect everything on board in your caravan. So if there's a storm and you get a surge, you're not going to blow your 240 volt fridge element or your hot water service element if you've got a uh, 240 volt gas hot water service. Uh, well worth a good look guys, about 89.95 will get you that. If the protector does go at any stage, they do sell cassette inserts, so you can buy that surge protector again off the shelf. A little bit cheaper because you're not buying the uh, waterproof housing. Keep your eye out for all the range of amphibian products, guys. Highly recommended. Uh, but once again, that's it for another episode of Tech Talk. Uh, if you've got any further inquiry or questions or even videos you'd like to see, why not drop us an email, sales at coastlinerv.com.au uh, and smash that like and subscribe button. Thanks, guys. Bye for now.